Our current caseload reflects what our practice is and the focus of our areas of practice. So we're representing people against big law firms that have defrauded them. We're representing people who are hurt by the trustees who were put in place uh, in confidence to manage their estate and to manage monies for the elderly members of their family. We're representing uh, victims of uh, police misconduct, uh, including jailer misconduct. Uh, including a, a, a person whose uh, mother, whose baby died while she was in custody, uh, and including another man, uh, Mr. Perry, who died while he was in custody because they ignored the medical condition that he faced. Uh, we're representing people challenging uh, corrupt election laws, uh, including representing the Independent Party of the State of California in a case that may go up to the U.S. Supreme Court. Uh, we're representing the Green Party in some cases to get ballot access in the states of Arizona. We're representing uh, Charles Johnson, uh, in cases against Twitter and in the case against the Senate Intelligence Committee, which is trying to improperly uh, get information about people solely based on their ethnic or uh, national origin. We're representing people falsely accused by the IRS of criminal tax evasion. A lot of our clients are not known to the world, though their identities might be famous, uh, because they're uh, being represented confidentially against the IRS or other people that have caused them harm. Uh, representing the uh, uh, a former director of uh, movies like Die Hard and the rest who lost his property to a corrupt bank action in Wyoming. Uh, representing a major New York uh, real estate uh, owner who also, when the big banks came calling, tried to crush him because they wanted to seize a $300 million opportunity for themselves. Uh, so we're suing big banks, we're suing big lawyers, we're suing big cops, uh, we're suing, we're going up against the IRS and this is what we do on a regular basis for our clientele. I fight for the underdog and win the impossible. I'm Robert Barnes.